Hello vloggy vlogsters, welcome to another weekly vlog in pandemic era. Um, I've just dropped Wesley off at my parents, I've just popped to the supermarket to grab some snacks and we're off away for the weekend. I'm very excited, uh, an actual away where we don't have to cook or clean. Ah! I've got a shepherd's hut booked, um, at kind of they call it a deconstructed hotel. Um, but basically it's got like a central restaurant and stuff and then it's just lots of like lodges and tree houses and things like that. Would have loved to have a tree house, but literally it felt like there was one shepherd's hut available for these two nights in the whole country, which is possibly true. So I'm just going to motor home, finish shoving stuff in a suitcase, grab Dan <laughs> and uh, we'll head off. So this place is amazing like so far it is amazing um the the hut is you can't really see it but the hut is super cute it's lovely we've got a king size bed full like big shower everything's tucked in quite neatly like as you would expect in a shepherd's hut but it's just beautifully done um we also have a wood burning stove over there the mini bar is entirely free and there's beer and prosecco in there <laughs> we've just sat in the hot tub for over an hour but Dan's still in there but we just sat in the hot tub for over an hour drinking some champagne having some chocolate oh, I think hopefully this is just going to be exactly the kind of off-grid weekend that we needed but very luxury off-grid <laughs> so I think the plans are I'm just going to sit here finish this um be cozy and then at some point Dan will come in and then we'll go and grab some pizza from the bar for dinner um it is 24 hour room service which is included as well um you can have pizzas up to 10 and then later there's like snack boxes and things but i think i should probably make the effort to go down and actually get some pizza at the bar have a walk through the gardens it looks utterly beautiful here i can't wait to go and have a walk around tomorrow <laughs> Bad news, 